gradient maps in Photoshop. What are they and what do we use them for? Let's get into this video. I'm going to show you exactly how we can make your photos really awesome with gradient maps. All right, let's get into Photoshop and I'm going to use this photo as an example. And if we go down here, we can apply a gradient map. And once we have this, we can select a gradient map. So let's say for instance, I want to select this gradient map. And you can see instantly the colors change. And here you can see this is the darker area. So when you select the color for the dark area, it's going to take this color and apply this to all the darker areas. In the middle, we have the gray tones, the mid tones. So if you select the color for the mid tones, it's going to apply this color to the mid tones. And the same goes for the highlights. I apply this gradient to this photo. And the only thing I actually do here is change the blend mode. Usually I just play around with these different blend modes to see which one fits best. Let's go for screen for this one. And you can see here the difference it makes to this photo. So this is just an example and you can also drop the opacity a bit to kind of find a nice range for this. Now here's another photo that we have. Let's apply a gradient map to this one and let's just select another gradient. I'm just going through these gradients and I can apply a different effect to my photo. And the only thing that I do here is just play with these blend modes to find a nice one. And that way you get a really cool effect by just applying a simple gradient map on any of your photos. And I think this is pretty cool, especially if you want to create a different effect on your photo and you don't have to go through the process of post-processing your photo. And by the way, all these gradient maps that you can see here, I will link them in the description of the video so you can download them and use them for your own photos to get really nice effects. So that's it for the gradient maps. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed the short content and catch you on the next one.